John, you're the winner last year. You were sick today. You weren't even sure you would finish, but you finished. Um, you were quite prominent towards the end. Yeah, I'm quite satisfied by my result, but uh, I'm a little bit disappointed in the guys that wins. And it would be very great if there was a doping control here, because I'm pretty sure that there's some things going on that's not 100%. And I really hope that the organizer of this race will take in consideration for next year to only either put it open control or invite people you know that's clean. I don't have it at four, uh, two years suspension and just come back from that. It's not fair on any, any level. Uh, my own performance, I'm pretty happy. I didn't even expect to finish, so... What was wrong uh, with you before the race? <coughs> huh? What did you feel was wrong before the race? When did you start feeling sick? I feel sick all the way, but I just had this feeling like, fuck no, I'm not giving up. And that's what driving me the whole season also. I don't like giving up and yeah, I didn't give up today. Probably shouldn't. I'm pretty sure in a few hours I'm gonna look like an old man. <laughs> but uh, we take it from there. <coughs> so, What's your plan now for the next few months? Uh, I'll go home to Denmark, take a rest. And uh, then I have uh, Lankavi. And I'm uh, really going for that. Last year I was 8 in TC. And I hope uh, to finish in top 3. What's your team plan for next year? I'm going back to CCN, cycling team. I was on the team last year and the team was... Uh, we had much more fun than we have on Baku. On Baku there's a lot of... Uh, what did you say? Politics. politics. And that kind of did ruin my contract this year. So, yeah. What can you do? Longer term, what's your goal? A couple of years down the line? I was hoping to go pro tour. Uh, I already had an agreement with the Pro Conti team and then they were folding. So you probably can think out what it was, but yeah, that's the way it is. So I wasn't expecting to go back to CCN. So I've really been trying to search for a good team and I also have pretty decent results to go. But it's just hard because there's not many people that take the results in Asia seriously. And yeah, it's fun when the European team comes here and they get really beaten down and they're like, oh, holy shit, they ride their bike pretty good in Asia. And I think that's pretty fun. Every time I bring a Danish team here, they just, even the last race we had, we had four Danish. The f four guys didn't even finish the race. And I was second in DC, so I'm like, yeah, you can learn it now. So it's pretty fun for me, but yeah, they get the experience, that's good.